All right, guys, so this is what the nursery looks like from the hallway. Um, it's kind of like an overview of the room, and I'm just going to take you guys on a tour of everything that's in here right now and show you some of the fun stuff I've got. So I'll just start over on this wall. So over here I have my old green dresser that you guys recognize from some of my old videos. Um, this was repainted by my mom. She just grabbed some chalk paint and she's amazing at what she does, but she actually was able to match the color of the dresser to the crib, which is amazing. So I don't have anything in this dresser right now because um, we don't have anything like organized um, and we're not going to buy anything new until the shower is over. But on the top here, I just have this changing pad and the cover is from Amazon. And then I've just got a couple of little like of my favorite outfits here for him. And then um, this little moose that my mom gave him, this little adventure sign. And then we've got just a Brandon bottle. It's like the only bottle we have. A pair of boots and a pair of Converse for him. And this is the gold um, shelf that was in my office before. And then over here, we just have a little corner um, with all of my husband's old baseballs from when he was a kid. And um, this was actually his as well. And so was this. And inside, we have a little picture of Scott and I and the dogs, <laughs> which is really cute. And then moving on over here. Oh, my phone is ringing. Let me just turn that off. And then moving over here, we just have our little rocker, which was also from Amazon. Um, a lot of the stuff in this room was actually a gift from my grandma, so <laughs> a lot of it is from Amazon. But that pillow is from Hobby Lobby. And then this is just the little rocker that comes on top of our pack and play. And I don't actually like this rocker at all. Um, it's just kind of going to be... I'm going to just move it, but it's just going to be used for when he's sleeping in the pack and play, and then I probably will never take it out and use it again. I just don't really like it, so I don't know. It just came with it. And then um, over here, we just have his car seat. This is the Britax B-Safe 335, and it's just black, and then there's a base under it. And then over here is just this cute little bookshelf. This is from Walmart, and I thought that our crib was going to be the same color, but it actually turned out to be darker. Um, but in there, we just have some books uh, because most of the other books have been brought to my mom's house where we're staying right now because uh, we like to read to him. And then down here is a blanket, and here are some swaddles that we've accumulated. We've got a cute little... These were Scott. This was Scott's toy when he was little. This one my parents brought back from... Europe and then just another little toy um, and then up here we've got <laughs> mom and dad again in our buffalo plaid shirts that's when Scott had a beard um, we've got Sully he growls <laughs> and then I plan on using this little jar for pacifiers and I only have two right now so I just put them in there this little statue is from Hobby Lobby and then these little pictures are from Lobby Lobby as well. And then this is our hamper, which is uh, the same maker as the sheets and the uh, changing pad thing. But this came from Amazon as well. And then I would pan up, but his name is actually posted up there, so I'm not going to pan up. But this is his little crib. Here's all his little stuffed animals that we've gotten. This one actually is from the um, gender reveal. Has his heartbeat in it. This one's from Cuddle and Kind. I love this one. It's so cute. I want to get the. T there's a bear one now, um, and then there's a couple of little lambs because this one was actually mine. And it's like a rattle. Um, this came from Scotland when my parents went to Scotland. And then we have our officer bear in here as well. I love this crib. This was originally I found it on at uh, Bye Bye Baby, but I did end up finding a cheaper one on Amazon, 
and yeah, that bears from Germany. <laughs> and then over here I just have my little diaper stash. I don't have a lot of diapers and the reason I don't is because I don't wanna buy a bunch of a size and then him be a different size. So I do have one pack for newborn and then two one and then a couple of Pampers, but I do plan on using Honest or Baby Gannix diapers. Um, and like I said, I, I don't want to have a ton because I also want to be careful if his body doesn't respond to a certain brand of diaper. I don't want to have like a stockpile and then I can't use them. So I just have these for now. I'll probably get one more thing of newborn diapers and then that's it. But I do also have a Costco brand um, baby wipe pack down there. I think that'll probably take us through the beginning. Um, so that's fine. And then... Down here is our little bear rug, which we got from Etsy. You can just type in um, bear floor rug and you'll find it. And then over here is just like this little wall with some cute pictures. Um, Scott and I again in our buffalo plaid shirts. I thought these pictures were so perfect for this room because obviously they match. So we have that. And then I will show you guys what's in the closet. So there's a lot of stuff in here right now. Um, the pack and play is in that. Um, the changing pad for the pack and play is here. This is a gift for my sister-in-law because she's also pregnant. Our stroller, which you guys have seen, and then he's got a ton of clothes already. Um, we've got our bath up there, our little diaper pail, um, some baby dish things. Um, this is actually Scott's baseball jersey from when he was a, a little kid so we're keeping that um, and I'll just kind of look like pan through all these clothes I don't have to show you much but these are all hand-me-downs from uh, one of my past students parents she brought me a bunch of these and then we do have lots of like cute police officer outfits actually two one is blue one is black uh, this one this one so cute and then we have lots of like little bear outfits because you guys know we call him little bear but nothing is organized by size um but just some cute stuff that we've accumulated this one was given to me by a student so cute scott wants to wash it so the glitter comes off um but yeah just some cute little things this one is silly i don't know I'm really picky with clothes. This one's hilarious. This one's so soft. But obviously, he has enough clothes for a while. These are like little like containers for like the car or in the living room to put diapers and wipes in, like things you need for when you're in there. And then up in that box is just a lot of Scott's old toys that are like too big for him right now, but we're keeping so that he has them. But yeah, this is the nursery, and it's such a shame that it has to come down, um, but it's for a good reason, because we are expanding and building a bigger home, and so this room, it will, this will keep the same decorations, it's just, it'll be a much bigger room, um, so there will be more space in here, and um, it'll be a lot more cozy, so. That's the nursery. I hope you guys liked it. I love this nursery. It is so cute. It's everything I dreamed it would be. And I think that our little boy will be perfectly comfortable in here. So thank you guys so much for watching. And we'll see you in the next one.